What's up guys, it's Cheese, and welcome back to another Star Wars The Old Republic commentary. Today we are playing on Swagness, aka our Jedi Sage. Yeah guys, sorry about the... there was like no time, I like joined within like two seconds, so I hopped on the speeder and then I started the video, so yeah, there was no time to do a really good introduction. So yeah, we're playing on the Civil War map, you know, and we're playing on our Sage. And, you know, if you know me, like always, I usually have a slow start, but, um, this match, it wasn't too slow. And if you guys who are also subscribers know that I don't keep on, like, oh gosh, I don't keep on, but I was looking at you guys' uh, comments, and you guys were always yelling at me about keep on. So, I started off, and I, if you look on the right-hand side of my, uh, quick bar, I have three, and actually four if you count the slow, slow feet thing. So I have four keybinds now. I'm trying to get used to using them, as you'll see. I like click on them every once in a while. But guys, just just give me a second, and I'll get down to it. One day, one day I'll be a, a master at this game. So yeah, we're in the middle, and right now we're just throwing what a usual damage stage would do is just throwing the diverse things and the projects and the blah blah blahs as I hold up. Alright, how to get a sip of sweet tea, you know? Mmm, that's good stuff. So yeah, we target the healer, this, uh, sage. And I was like, oh no you don't. Oh no you don't. So I just go down here and I'm just like, alright, I'ma, I'ma fuck you up, nigga. And so, yep, I'm just throwing everything I got at him. I'm getting shot at. Going down here, uh, up, uh, up, uh, using the heals. And we are going to get him right there. So we kill the healer and now it's just... It's kind of easy now that the healer's gone, so we're just throwing everything I got, like usual, at him. Target the operative, and yeah, so yeah. And, um, for you guys that were following my Shadows Revan series, I am sorry to say that, um, there was, like, a bug going on in my game, and I couldn't log on to, like, my clone. Like, every time I logged on to it, my computer would freeze, and it, it just wouldn't work, so now I can't log into my clone at all until, like, they fix the bug. So until then... I'm probably uh, not going to be able to play on my clone, and I'm just not going to do the series anyways. Like, it's getting like 20 views a video, so it's not really even worth it, but I mean, it's okay. I'll throw out some Swator PvP videos, because I know you guys love that. <laughs> I'll probably uh, upload the new operation that's coming out with the Shadow of Revan 2 when I finally get a group together to do that, because I'm only like level 56. So, once I get to level 55, that will... In D, I mean, level 60. So you're saying 55. Well, once I get to level 60, that'll definitely happen. So yeah, we're at grass. Um, and I was trying to target that mercenary the whole time, but she was, like, running away from me. So, you know, it's kind of kind of difficult. Now we're... Oh, no, no, never mind. I'm targeting... God damn it. Different video, different video. Okay, hold up. S sweet tea again. Uh, and I am also so hyped... So my Panthers, my Panthers actually won today. Woo! We like whooped the Saints today. Sorry if you guys are any, if there's any Saints fans out there, but uh, the Panthers. Oh man, they like creamed and it was like 48 to 10, something like that. I was, oh man, it was it was a good day to be a Panther. Good day to be a Panther as we're killing this operative right here. Oh, that's what I love about uh, telekinesis. I don't know what it's called, but the uh, number five ability on my thing. You can like move while channeling it, so it's like. Perfect. It is perfect for a sage. As we uh, get followed here by an assassin, I'm trying to like escape so hard. I'm like, ah, oh god. So I just go into my defense mode here as we put on a force barrier, and my teammates save me as they uh, heal me up and guard him or scare him away. So full health again. And now we're just gonna, you know, do what we always do: just shooting bubbles of force at them. Bubbles of force. Bubbles of force. Ah. Uh, uh distribution and shit. I have to admit, the Sages, um, well, for this new update out, I don't think they got debuffed too hard or nerfed too hard. Um, that number one ability is new. I'm pretty sure it's new. It's it's pretty powerful. And, you know, it's all good. It's all good if you're a Sage. I have to admit, if you're a Gunslinger or a Sniper, it was kind of, it was iffy, but for Sages, it's on point. It's all good. So, we're targeting the healer again. Chasing them down. Oh man. Oh man. He had no chance. No chance. As this juggernaut just jumps on the whole team. Yeah, he had. He has no chance. He gets totaled. And so, yep. Just gonna heal up. Da -da -da. As our team moves grass, 
I like looked at it and I was just like, Psh, they don't need me. They don't need me. Ah, sorry guys, sweet tea. Sweet tea's too good. Sweet tea's too good. So yep, just garden middle. Just trying to see if I could discover a a dude there, like a stealth dude. But no, we don't. Target the mercenary, but he like moves out of range. And I was like, God damn it! Why you do this? Why why you gotta make me stand on the ledge? And then that juggernaut was just giving me like the death stare, and I was like, Oh god, I'm ready. Look, I had my cursor on the fucking wave. I was like ready for him to jump me. So he's like, oh, he thinks he's all cool, but then we spark kick him off. And from there, like, all my teammates just fuck him up. Like, he had no chance. But, you know, I'm going to chase down that healer. I, oh, nope, I'm just going to scare him off, actually. He, like, saw that I was looking at him. He was like, oh, shit, Swagness is looking at me. Oh, and he hauls ass. So we noticed that there's a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton of people at grass. So I was just like, all right, we got to head over there and save the day. As that operative goes invisible, I'm just like, oh, we're going to poke out. And I saw him, and I was just like, ah, chase him down! And, yep, we get him just in time. Well, no, she lives. Never mind. I lied to you guys. And then I get stunned, so... Waiting for that unstunned to happen. Let's fuck up that merc. That merc. Come on, yeah. Fight me! Fight me! Yeah. Alright, here we go. So close to death. I really hate that the sage doesn't have, like... A uh, less than a, like, you know how there's like a flourishing shot or something like that? To where it's like 25% less healing received? I really wish the Sage had one of those, and it would be OP, but come on. I think every class deserves one of those, because when I'm trying to target like a healer or something, they just heal themselves right back up, and I'm like, God, God damn it! Ah, ah. But yeah, so we're, we're just gonna do what the Sages do and do damage, you know? Fucking sorcerers, man. I'm so jealous of sorcerers, like, I wish I chose to be a sorcerer instead of a sage right now. Because literally, lightning is so much better than force. Like, people say, oh, dude, no, they're they're even, they're even. No. No, they're not. Okay, they have cooler abilities, like, it looks cool, like, who fucking wants to throw pebbles? Like, literally, force channel is, like, so cool, it's just like, psh, force lightning everywhere, and then, fucking us, technesis throw, it's like pebbles. Like, that's not even cool. I want to be throwing rocks and shit, not... Pebbles, and so yeah, it's like I don't even know. It's sorcerers are way cooler, I think. And then uh, earthquake, earthquake is shit. They have their force like rainstorm thing that is awesome. So in my opinion, sorcerers are just way cooler than sages. But sages in general, still a pretty good class. Just saying, yeah, my opinion on the world. All right, so that guy almost captures it. Is he, is he gonna capture it? Oh. Oh, no, he doesn't. Our teammate saved it. As we kill that dude right there. And, yep. Yep, he's... We're gonna kill him? We're gonna kill him? And for you guys out there that are actually watching for, like, tips, I'm not that good with the sage, but I know one thing that will help you. If you're targeting a, uh, a shadow, a Sith shadow, I mean, a Sith assassin or Jedi shadow, always use... Always slow him down, like, First ability you want to do is weaken mind, and then you want to do slow force instantly, so they like can't get you, cause that's like the only thing that assassins do. They like run at you, and then they get behind you. But if you slow them down, if you slow them down, then you're good, and then you can just like force away or force speed away and shoot them up. That's tip number one for me. Yeah, yeah. As we put a bubble on all of our teammates, boop boop boop, force bubble, force protection. Alright, so, basically just walking around now. And I saw everyone going snow, and I was like, oh, are they already quitting? Like, all of them are already quitting? So I look over there, and I, you know, and our teammates in the chat, like, look at them. They're just like, bro, we are heroes, bro. And I was like, okay, what's going on in the chat? But, um, so I thought everyone was, like, quitting over there, so I was like, oh, game's over. Didn't even look at grass. You're gonna see me look at grass in a second, and I'm gonna be like, oh, shit. But, yeah, I, I just didn't even notice that there was a fight going on. I thought everyone just on the Sith side was down over there. So, yeah. Feel free to skip a minute or so, because I'm gonna 
I'm a little derpy right here. I'm just staring at Sith. As okay, now, now I think we go over the grass. Am I right? Am I right? Yeah, I think I'm right. And we were so close to going invincible in this map too. You're gonna notice. I'm like, oh shit, there are so many Sith there. So I mean, like, I was willing to sacrifice my life to save it, as they get it. And I was like, oh god, what? What? Are, now there's no point. So I was thinking about um one v one in this dude that came at me right here. And I was like, oh dude, I I'm gonna fuck you up. You have no chance. But then um then their team came, their whole team came after me, and I was just like. God damn it. I tried to get away, but I it was too impossible. So I'm just like trying my best. I was like, no, there's no four speed there. And I was like, no, no, the record. I have to go zero depths, zero depths. Ah, oh my God. Well, yeah, I couldn't, couldn't escape an operative. He was like doing that little shield thing where he jumps all over the place. So we don't go invincible, but we do go throughout the whole match basically invincible, which is, you know. Good enough for me. One death. One death's all good. And, yep. Da, 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 da. So, hopefully, guys, this wasn't too bad of a of a Sage video for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the, the gameplay. I thought I got pretty good at this class. I mean, uh, you guys are probably like, Dude, you suck. You think you're good. You fucking suck. My grandma could play better than you. But, no, I mean, I... I bleh. Bleh. Chewing all my words, but you know, I think I was pretty good this game. If you guys have any sage tips you'd like to give me, I'm all down for it, because I mean, hey, there's always room for improvement, am I right? I'm trying to learn the keybinds, and guys, I promise once I do, um, I shall become amazingly epic as we get in a mini fight with this assassin right before the, uh, the time runs out. And hold up, just give me a second. I was like, what? What did I do? Where's my score? And it took me a little while to figure out that I accidentally clicked on the enemy thing instead of the all. I was like, oh, 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 there we go. There we go. So look at all that damage I did. Mm, I think I was like third best on the team in damage. Made me feel a little good. But alright guys, so thanks for watching. I'm out. Peace.